talk about Mama June spending Honey Boo Boo's Hey, Kel, I wanted to respond to your video out of everybody's video because you have been on TV. Okay, let's answer this. Let's start back from 2011, October 12, 2011. That was Tyler and Jerry's. We did three episodes of that. With TLC, we got paid nothing. They paid Alana's entry fees, and that was it. Then they came to us with a contract in 2012, and we were on there from 2012 to 2014. Um, and through that time, there was no mention of cooking accounts. Um, it was just a lump sum at that time, and then I went and, like, kind of divvied it up, and then when the kids wanted something, they got it, um, tons of, like, family vacations and just stuff like that. Um, have I ever had a financial advisor? No. Um, have I ever had an investor? No. Um, I've had some people in my circle kind of screw me over with money, and do I wish I had that money back? Most certainly. Um, let's fast forward to Mama Jean from Not Too Hot that started in 2015. Um, they again did not say anything about a cooking account. I did not learn about cooking accounts until I went on, Alana went on Dancing with the Stars Junior Edition. And at that time, everybody that had been there had been like people on Disney Moms and, you know, some other big time celebrities that have kids. And they were like, well, you only put 20%, the other 80%, you know, you can do whatever. But at the end of the day, you, yes, I could have put 100% in there. Yes, most certainly I could have. Um, but the minimum was 20%. So I was like, okay, was I in my drug addiction? Yes. Is that an excuse? No. Um, so 20% went into that and we moved forward. Um, flash forward to 2000, in 2019, 2020, when Alana went to go live with Pumpkin, um, the show made Pumpkin set up an account in LA, an entertainment bank or whatever. And so Alana wanted to have 75% put in her hand in an account that she could be able to touch the money. But they decided, they talked her out of it, and she only did 50%. So, 50% of Mama June from Not to Hot Money, $160,000, is in a Coogan account in California still today. Just like my money in the Wells Fargo's account, $35,000, Alana hasn't touched. So, with that being said, Alana was able, between 14 and 18, to have $160,000. So, that totals up to be like $320,000, okay? That's a lot of money for between a 14 and an 18 year old, but Alana had some bills to take. Alana was paying bills and everything else. And y'all all know she was on her own um, since she was 16. It is what it is. Ain't what it ain't. Hate me if you want to, but I had no say so over it. Uh, at that time, Pumpkin had temporary guardianship. Um, then we did a mass singer, and so her payments would not be delayed. Pumpkin and Alana decided that 70% would go into Alana's hands and only 30% would go into the Coogan account that I had at Wells Fargo, which made it to a total of $35,000. Have I said I'm sorry? Have I said this? Have I said that? Yes, I most certainly have. Even back in July, I told her that I would pay her back the $30,000 even when they walked away and didn't want to hear anything. Um... Anna got very, very sick, and my main goal is was to take care of Anna. And Alana said, oh, I don't need the money. It's just whenever you get the money, you can pay it $10,000 at a time, $20,000, $5,000, or you pay $30,000. And I told her I would give everything to her. Then we had a vacation at the end of February to celebrate Anna in Florida, and we talked about it again. I know I did not bring a cashier's check and hand it over to her. But Alana is going to be in town this next week, or supposed to be for spring break. I haven't had the time to go to Colorado, and she has not been back to Georgia since we talked in the end of February. I am going to give her back $30,000. Um, we're going to do it the right way. Um, we want to be able to have her sign something that she has agreed to, saying, okay, every bit of money is paid back, and it's squashed, and everything else not just for my protection, but also for Alana's protection and to kind of move forward. I've been trying to move forward, and unfortunately for two years, this has bothered Alana, and I wish that that didn't. Um, I even was upset about that. I was like, if it bothered you for two years, you should have came to me. We could have sat down because they got bank statements every quarter that I gave to them, and they knew exactly what was in there the whole time. So Alana 
FYI, has $160,000 of her Mama June from Not the Hot Money that's in a Coogan account in California. She hasn't touched. She still has $35,000 in the Wells Fargo account that she has not touched. Um, plus, I will be giving her $30,000 um, from the dancing.